Now, still to come, 25 years since they took the world by storm. The brothers from Hanson have gone solo to write their new music, but they're still together to sing it. How does that work? <laughs> they're here next. You're watching Good Morning Britain on ITV. Air Conditioning, proud sponsors of Good Morning Britain National Weather. My goodness, haven't they grown? It's 25 <laughs> years since Hanson's Mbop took the world by storm. Now, though, the boys from Oklahoma are back with new music. And they're here in the UK on their new tour. Isaac, Taylor and Zach join us now straight, uh, straight from Nottingham. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Right. yeah. How was that, Zach? Uh, it was great. It was yeah. amazing, yeah. We uh, played last night and uh, it feels really good to be playing all over the place, be in London in a couple of days. And been uh, all over Europe all, over. all month, so yeah. uh, we've been enjoying it. Right. You're in London right now, by the way. <laughs> yes, we are, yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, in London for a concert. Well, yeah, well, yeah, yeah we're, we're playing <laughs> we're, Roundhouse <laughs> in a few days. I think it's Thursday is when we play Roundhouse. It's, yeah. we're, I mean, we're making yeah. up so much of, you know, all the musicians are kind of making up for the last two years oh. of quiet. Yeah. But this is kicking yeah. off, uh, I think, 90-plus shows around the world. So, yeah. a lot. UK, great to be here. Do you know what? I'm just watching you back then, and, and I... I can see that you, you really embrace that fame at a mm -hmm. young age. Mm -hmm. You know, that it can go one of a couple of ways, can't it? <laughs> okay. um, I know that Robbie Williams quite recently said that fame should come with a government health warning. <laughs> um, I think, yeah, he's you know, right. Oh. Particularly, it can affect you when you're very young. I, I mean, how, how did you all deal with it? I, I think that you have to know who you are in the first place. I think, I think we had a real advantage of being songwriters and... Uh, first, and, and so the music that we put out into the world, whether it's Umbop or whether it's songs like I Will Come to You Weird, whereas I love some of those early you know, s singles from that first record, those are all our voice and those are all, all kind of our lyrics and what, what we wanted to put into the world. And so I think we had a real advantage in that area. A lot of young artists starting off don't have some of mm -hmm. that. And you can still hear those same messages in the new stuff we're doing, right? There's a new album out right now. Yeah. It's three parts, and you still, you still hear the same stories mm. in the songs. But you do you stay survive. Sad? I mean, you were six. Yeah, I was six when we started. I was about 11 during Umbop era when we first came yeah. to the UK. How do you grow and mature as a person <laughs> with all of that well, going there's, on? There's all kinds well, of different don't. choices. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's yeah, true, actually. Yeah. Brother. You, they, My brother. Yeah. You, 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 music, music does give you a little bit of license to stay a kid for a little yeah. longer than... I think well. it's also pretty good therapy, going on stage I, and writing songs. I, I know how Isaac dealt with fame. <laughs> he married one of his fans. <laughs> so, yeah, sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah no, you know, he was I, in the fifth I, row. I, I, oh, yeah, there's, I yeah. have yeah. heard yeah. that uh, you, you usually meet your mate at work yeah. so uh, yeah we yeah. you know work for I mean, us is concerts you know you see a pretty face like that you know you gotta you gotta Talk get to know her through that moment i'm, just, I'm sure you're sick it. of talking about it but you were performing and you see this lovely lady yeah. in mm -hmm. row, mm -hmm. and then yeah. what happens uh i i very i made a, a bit of an ass of myself <laughs> forgive my friend sorry and uh and uh you know said uh i tried very hard to get her attention and yeah. apparently sure you got her you attention. Yeah, 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 exactly. Well, you are on the stage. Yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah, but, you know, it's not so easy. I mean, you know... You, you, you have to have security go escort her back. Oh, you exactly. really can't leave. Yeah, exactly. You know, this, that, <laughs> That's going to cause brain damage. Yeah. This lifestyle is like, yeah, this is exactly. normal. That is kind uh, of normal. Uh, uh, yeah. It's a strange well, life. Uh, also, you're meeting someone who you instantly know likes you. I mean, yeah. that was a positive <laughs> sign. Yeah, I could it really, it was, really like you. It was, it was. Yeah, you know. But you never really know how that... I mean, just because you... Just because you see a pretty face in the audience doesn't mean that you get get along well doesn't mean that yeah. you know personalities click but it clicked and and uh I was uh, very grateful for that. And you, we have three I, kids because of it. You do. And Taylor and Zach, you both met people that you met through work. Mm -hmm. yeah, you, yeah. Two yeah. lovely women who yeah. worked on your shows. Yes. And what I think is really impressive is that you all have very strong, long-lasting yeah. marriages. Yeah. 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 You've been married 20 years. This year, 20 16, years. 16, 16, yeah. I mean, I think knowing, I mean, going back to not kind of going crazy, I mean, we, we were always songwriters, we were always performers, we were always musicians. That's really, it says musician if you describe our, mm -hmm. you know, our, Occupation yeah. it doesn't say famous person or yeah. celebrity. It says yeah. like that's what we do, and so I think having that sense of this is who we are, 
um, is a big foundation it's and having so, a partnership. Uh, that's such a good point, I think, for anybody who yeah. wants to be famous. It's about the work. Right. Absolutely. Right. Love what You're, you do. You yeah. love what you do. And what, you know, it's not loving being famous, no, although no. I'm sure there are perks. Absolutely. It's loving making the music. And each Absolutely. of you individually has been songwriting and you mm -hmm. bring that all together on the album. Yeah, yeah. yeah the, this latest record that we put out called Red, Green, Blue, each color represents each brother. And we, for the first time, you know, we, we spent all these years doing stuff together. And for the first time, we decided maybe we deconstruct the band and mm -hmm. break the record into three parts. And each brother basically on their own Brought wrote songs. five songs, produced five songs. And we played on each other's stuff. But it was like, okay, Tay, what do you want to do? Okay, Zach, what do you want to do? Yeah. And, and more, more, like, more like we were studio musicians as opposed <laughs> to, like, giving Zach way too many, you know, opinions about his side. Right. Yeah. <laughs> well, look, it's great to see you. Uh, where are you playing next? We are playing in Glasgow. Glasgow next, and we're all over the UK. We've got, as I said, playing in London on Thursday yeah. uh, and all yeah. over the UK. Yeah. 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 You can find out. I love it. Brilliant. It's, do you know what? It's great to see you. Thank you you seem much. really healthy. And <laughs> with it fantastically. We're, we're good actors. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Thank, Thank you, guys. Uh, uh, all the very best. Good morning, Britain. It's back tomorrow from 6. Here's Lorraine.